How's the nose feeling? Uh, as it, as a blood sense. Has not, so. Hello everybody, welcome back. Today is a beautiful day here in Utah. It's almost 80 degrees and it feels like summer and I am loving it. Tomorrow, Carmen has a field trip and they're gonna go to a park nearby and they're gonna build a Monarch Way Station. And so her teacher has asked each student to bring some flowers and a few things like that to contribute to this way station. So I'm gonna take her to Walmart really fast and see if we can find some of the flowers that the Monarchs love and we'll help her plant those tomorrow. And we've also been put in charge of bringing popsicles to share with the class. So we're gonna head to Walmart and get that done really fast before Owen has his baseball game. Carmen's teacher sent home this great big list of different flowers that monarchs love. Carmen knows a few of them. He brought this list along with us just in case Walmart doesn't have the ones that she knows of. Hopefully someone can help us find something that's on this list. Which types of flowers do monarchs love? Um, well, number one, the first favorite flower, not milkweed, but like flower is probably a sunflower. Okay. And then they also really like, we need milkweed, I assume they're gonna bring milkweed, but they also really like, like mint leaves. Mm -hmm. I don't know really any other flowers besides that. Yeah. Like a common cell, sunflower, geez, or a golden Okay, let's go in here and see if we can find some sunflowers. There's lots of options on there, huh? Yeah, but we only need to bring one, so. Just one? Yeah, because I only made one flower tag, so. Oh, okay. One for one for all. We have, this is sweet basil right here. It's basil. Got lemongrass, rosemary. Should we get some and plant it? Don't need those, we're looking for mint leaves. Mm -hmm. All I see is basil. Is I don't think so. Okay, well, let's go in here. Snapdragon. Sorry, snapdragons. Where are you? No daisies. I don't think there's gonna be anything right here. You don't think? Let's go down. No petunias. Let's go right over here. There's right over there is the garden section. Let's go over there and check if we can find some mint leaves. So, just found a plant on the list. So this plant is on the list. Corspispus and <laughs> Corspispus. Nice. Do you want to get that one? Or do you want to go look outside and see if they have anything different? We'll save this one for later. Let's go look at what else they have. Okay. All right, so we've decided on this flower for her to plant. She's still looking for some seeds, maybe some mint leaves. Can you find anything? No, but I'm kind of going for the zenas. You're kind of leaning towards the zenas? Yeah. Just the sunflowers, probably any kind it would love, don't you think? Well, what else is there on the asters? I don't want to get an aster. They have it. Why don't we try some of the zenas right here. Yeah, we can plant a couple of those and see how these they turn out. Or what this one, this one, or this one? You choose. Which one do you want? Okay. This one seems thicker with more seeds, and so we'll Okay, perfect. But it smells like it has no seeds. What the heck? Yeah, there's a few in there. I think that's good. I don't want to smash them. Okay, stick it in the cart. We got to go find all the popsicles. I want this zena. All right, great. Let's go. This one. Okay. Yeah, this one has a lot more in it. Okay, here we go. Carmen chose to get the Freedom Pops for her class. So that's what we got. Because they're the best pops. Those will be yummy, huh? They're the best pops. Pretty good. Okay, I think we're all set for this field trip tomorrow. Yep. I think that the ocean guy, Rubble, he's my favorite. He's a pretty him. cool fan. I love Rubble. First of all, he's yellow and he's a funny dog. And he's I kind of want that fan just for the light show. I know, me too. Don't you? <laughs> I think there's candy in here. You want to get it? Turn it back on again. Let me see all the pictures.
whole thing is awesome. Okay, better finish checking out. Can we get it? No. Carmen and I just got home from Walmart. We got everything she needed for tomorrow, and now it is time to head up to Owen's baseball game. We are excited to watch him play. This is one of the last few games. He has two more next week, and then he is done with baseball. How's inside, buddy? Watch the ball, take a deep breath. Guys, we just got back from Owen's game. They ended up losing by one tonight. They didn't have enough players to fill the roster. So you only had like six players. Basically the infield was all they had. Yes, and, uh, and they played the best team in the league tonight and just about beat them. I know. Losing if, by one point to the best team is pretty dang good. If they would have had some half outfielders. <laughs> I know, if they would have had some outfielders, that game would have been over. They would have won by at least three or four runs. But yes. Uh, a little heartbreaking, but we are getting a late dinner going. That's nine o'clock. Uh, the baseball went super long, so uh, I'm having some pot stickers tonight. They are almost done. The kids are having some hamburgers. Terry just got those thrown on the grill, so probably another 20 30 minutes on those, and they'll be ready to go. The burgers are done. Claire's probably got to be starving. She's been over the Binghams doing what? Selling ICs. Selling ICs and drinks, just kind of trying to make a few bucks. How much did you make today? $23. 23 bucks? That's quite a bit. 20, Man, you cashed in. Yeah. Quite the entrepreneur. All right, let's get these buns open. I can. Let's get these burgers on there. Do you need some help? Yes. Here, let's try it. A little harder than normal, aren't they? Yeah. One bun for Claire. One bun for Carmen. One bun for Owen. Even though he's not here yet, Austin is coming soon. Let's get the lettuce going. Of course, Carmen has a mound of pickles on her burger. You gonna keep adding to it? Just eat them. Remember, you want those kind of pickles on your burger too? No. Okay. How about some lettuce? Yes, please. How about? Can I get some ketchup? Sure. I only touched one. The other kids have finished their dinner and Austin is finally up from the basement. He's been down there trying to grind on his homework, trying to get things done by the end of the year. Looks like he is having a Rice Krispie treat before dinner. Is that correct? Yeah. Why are we having door. Rice Krispies before dinner? Because it's essential. It's not essential. You should eat your burger first. He's warming his burger up right now. He didn't come eat it when, he was, when it was hot. Oh. What else has been going on, Bob? Just got done writing my essay, actually. I know. The end of school is coming up quick. We cannot wait for it to be over. Do you have a lot more schoolwork to do? Uh, actually, not really. I kind of got most of it done. Awesome. So, that's, that's, that's great. That's good. How's the nose feeling? Uh, has, it, has it bled it since? It has not, so it's good. Good. Awesome. I'm glad it's fixed. Yeah. So cool. somebody did comment and say that it only worked for a while, and they, they had to go back in and have it fixed again. But we're hoping this one lasts. I think it will. Let's so. pray. Are you feeling all right, other than that? I still have a pretty bad head cold. Got a bad head cold? Shoot. Yeah. Other than that though, I'm doing okay. Good, hopefully that goes away soon. Austin has been crazy busy with his schoolwork, so I'm just able to catch him as he's like going to the fridge, grabbing a quick bite to eat, and just kind of talking to him as he's uh, trying to get some dinner, but he's gonna finish up, go downstairs, work a little bit more on his score before bedtime, but it is getting late. We finally got all the kiddos in bed and we are headed there ourselves. You guys, it's been just crazy the past few weeks around here. I feel like we're all running on empty and we need some extra sleep. So we're gonna go to bed. Thank you guys for watching today. We'll see you guys back here tomorrow.